Okay. So we're going to negotiate. I'm you. I'm the landlord. I'm the guy with the master shirt on. And you are negotiating. Do you want to be pizza again? Okay. And you don't like my rent. And you want to say that we don't have enough parking. And you want to, you know, pull up your vehicles and, you know, it's dominoes or whatever. And, you know, let me have it. Okay. So. So we're already past. You're Reagan, right? Reagan. Okay, so Reagan. So we're, we're negotiating the LOI. Okay? So, hi, Reagan. I'm, I've sent you the, the LOI. You know, you have it right here in front of you. Is there any issues you want to go over before we get it signed up so I can get a lease drafted? Yeah, I'd like to see more PI and I'd like to see the market this year. Wow, more TI. Help me understand that when we met earlier. You, we talked about what you were going to invest and what we were going to invest, so I'm confused. Uh, it's going to cost me about a quarter million dollars to build out my investment. So it might cost me like five or six dollars. Ah, yeah, I, I understand. I understand. I, I wish that could be different. Unfortunately, my budget is three dollars, as we discussed prior. Um, is there any other funding sources that you have to make up the difference? So that's a big difference that you were expecting. Yeah, you can give it free rent for you. I can't really do that. I like tenants who are open and paying rent. It's really important. How? Tell me where you got your numbers from. The 250, because earlier it was about 100, if I recall. Uh, I don't know what those are. Okay. And has he built um, other pizza restaurants in the past? Yes. Okay. And 250. I've, I, I've done a lot of pizza restaurants. That's a big number. What's going in that number? We have to put in our restaurant. We have to put in a uh, big system. And we do very fancy uh, brickwork. Um, and what we do, we, would, uh, we do a brick oven in the middle of it. Right, you mentioned that to me. But I thought in that first call you had said that you had a really good connection when we spoke initially that you had really good connection with all of this equipment. Did something happen with that connection? That guy was lying. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't lie. I really only have three dollars a square foot to give you. I really want to do the deal. So, well, let's put that aside for a second. Let's talk about the rent. So, you know, when we when we originally you, we spoke, you said you were going to do X. X amount in revenue. I told you the rent, you know, at Braylon Village was thirty dollars a square foot. We just invested six million. We discussed that. Um, and you're thinking now that the rent should be. And we had. I thought we had agreed to the thirty, but you're thinking the rent should be what? And help me understand how we got there. Because the guy down the street uh, just recently shopped so much for for twenty five dollars a foot. Yeah, the same draw which you buy the new Okay, so newer, same draw. So originally had you been talking to them as well? Yes. Okay. So when you told me that you like Braylon Village because of the all the beautiful new things we did, has that have you changed your mind on that? No, absolutely. You still like Braylon. Okay. So do you think so we have a Publix? And that center down there has a wind basin. Right. So do you think that, how many people do you think come to Braylon Village on a weekly basis versus wind basin? Um, do you think more or less go to Publix versus wind basin? <laughs> more or less. Does your wife, I met, I met lovely Melissa. Does Melissa shop at Publix or Win Dixie? Okay. And um, you had mentioned earlier when we talked about your revenues that your price points for your pizza were going to be a little higher. If, if I recall, we, that's one of the other reasons you like Braylon because of our benches and our lighting. You know, it's, we're, we're really catering to a more of a village concept. And we talked about how you like the consumers coming in, and it's a different consumer. Do you see this? I, I'm with you if you think like the traffic is the same, but tell me about the traffic at Braylon, the consumers versus the consumers at my friend's center down the street. Uh, yeah. Uh, higher than, uh, higher than, uh, 
So it's five. So you want to do twelve hundred square feet, right? Twelve hundred square feet, and it's five dollars a square foot difference. So that's six thousand a year difference. And if we divided that by, you know, twelve months, five hundred divided by thirty days, that's what. Who's got a big deal calculator? Seven. Okay. So your average pizza costs what? Fifteen bucks. So do you think? I'm just curious. Do you think that you could sell one or two more pizzas a, a day at Braylon versus my friend Swin Dixie? No. You don't. <laughs> Then you need to go to my friend's Win Dixie. <laughs> so okay, so you obviously do. So the rent, the rent's no longer an issue. You would believe that I'm justified on the 30. Am I justified on the 30? Based on what we, the little exercise that we just went through. Because if you don't think you can, if you don't think you can do two pizzas extra a day, then I agree you should go there. I want you here, but. If you don't think you can do do two more pizzas here, then this is not the place for you. But I really want you here. But it's thirty. It's not twenty-seven fifty. It's thirty. Thirty is the number. I can't. You know. I can't. I cannot help you. Again, we just spent six million dollars. On the property, so what's the other option? Can't do it. <laughs> I want you to have investment, and I think I can help. I've got a guy Bob in my office. He knows a lot of contractors. We got to get you some more bids. I've never heard of a two hundred and fifty thousand dollar pizza restaurant. I'm thinking, and I don't want you to be that much in debt. I want to help you. So let me have. I'll give you Bob's. We're first responders. He'll call you right away. He's going to give you some three other contractors to call. Let's get that 250 down. My three dollars is market. Would you agree? Was a guy going to give you more than three dollars down the street? Uh, yes. How much more? Yeah, three dollars. Three dollars. Yeah. Well, I can only do three, but I'm going to help you get those numbers down. I believe you're going to be more successful here, and I really, really, really want to have you here. I like you. I loved meeting Melissa. <laughs> Love to have you, but I can't. I wish I could do more. And if we can't do business together, I wish you luck, and I'll come eat pizzas at your Windixie place. But I hope I'm eating pizzas here. Okay. So, asking questions, asking questions, asking questions, getting him to say it. Are we doing that? Are we doing that out there, or are we throwing up and showing up? 